Happy Saturday, everybody. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com with a fresh case, half case break of the brand new 2018 Topps Museum Collection Baseball. This is a six box. Pick your team number five from jazbeeshobbyland.com. Here are the players involved in break five. Thank you. Thanks, everybody, for getting into the action. Dustin with that last spot mojo. All right, now let's see which half of the case we're going to do. All right, so there's six boxes on the left side, six on the right side. With a dice roll, one, two, three, four, five, six. Five. We'll be doing the right side. And this side, we will reserve for pick your team number six, which is already full. So we'll be breaking that right after this. So we'll just write six here. All right, and here are six boxes for break number five. Five on the dice roll, five on the pick your team. All right, good luck. Dustin's asking, if you, if you send me an Orioles hat, would I wear it for one break? I don't know if I can as a Dodgers fan. That would be cheating on the Dodgers. Pretty intense about my fandom, Dustin. Can't just wear any hat willy-nilly. Ordinary gamers in the house. All right, good luck, everybody. I know, right, Big Rig? I should. There's Ozzy Albius, and there's Anthony Rizzo. Braves, Cubs, that'll Eric Rittenhouse with the Braves, and Scott McNulty with the Cubbies. There are these guys. It's over here. Why do I have to? Oh, we got two hits in this one. Okay. We got a we got a two hitter. John Cards asking if Elite is on the schedule for if it sells, it'll be on the schedule. If it sells out, we'll do it. Every break is always on the schedule. There's Kyle Schwarber revealing a Diamondback for Joe P. Nice Jake Lamb, forty six out of one ninety nine. That's a nice patch up there. For the snakes, my Dodgers trying to chase the snakes, trying to catch them. Behind the canvas is Byron Buxton, 33 out of 199. Nice one for the Twins. That'll be for Eric. And behind the Altuve is Chris Davis, 25 out of 99. Quad relic for the O's. That'll be for Michael Booth. Joe Ivor says, you need a good one. Joe, you haven't been getting good ones? Wow. How about a, man, that Jacob deGrom, Noah Syndergaard autographs weren't enough? 
So demanding, Joe Ivers. Uh, next one is Aaron Nola, 114 out of 299. Nice one for the Phillies. Behind Roberto Clemente. You need dazzling, I see. Behind Roberto Clemente is a one-of-one one Brandon Crawford. Opposite Joe Mojo. Going oppo is James. James Butts with the Giants. Nice. All aboard! Woo-woo! Still got to give the train whistle, even though it's a, a giant. Probably put this on Twitter, too. One of one. Nice. I'll put it on Twitter just to show that I'm not not that anti-giant. Some of my best friends are giants. Giants fans. Okay, so Amazing wants a Hall of Fame. Amazing HOF. Joe Ivers, who has the Mets and the Astros, and wants a Twitter-worthy card. I see. He needs a dazzling hit. Maybe something like that. That is Arthur. Only one of them out there. Impressive, isn't it? That's it. That's the only one. Is that the frame? That might be the frame in there, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, what about the athletics, Curtis? Nice. There's the gold frame right there, which I think is out of 10. All right, so good luck. Any guesses or hopes on the frame? All right, there's Mariano Rivera, 24 out of 99. We will top load these before they get shipped out. And Cody Bellinger for the Dodgers out of 150. The hatred ranking level for the California teams. Um, no, only the Giants, really, just because just because they're our, our, our rivals. But the the A's are in a different um, in a different league. They're in the American League, so. Oh, save that Otani there, too. All right, so behind Byron Buxton is Gary Sheffield, Dodgers edition. 93 out of 99, old chef. Nice chef for the Dodgers, Eric, with that one. And then behind Honus Wagner is Trey Turner, the speedster, 44 out of 75. Mothers added, do the Dodger Giants fans battle each other like Boston and the Yankees fans? Yes. The rivalry is just as intense. Remember when they were all in New York? There's Trey Turner. <coughs> Excuse me, primary, I'm losing my voice. Primary pieces for Robert. And then behind Chris Bryant is another giant. Brandon Crawford, 22 out of 35. I guess you could, you could start making a rainbow now. Giants. It's another one for James. All right, and the frame. Um... Sorry, Ordinary, what, what's the question? Yeah, these cards are nice. Is Museum just the series, not old school? Yeah, it's the name of the product. All right. Joe P. wants Randy Johnson. Oh, it's not just old players. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a mix of everybody. But the design, you know, they're just kind of getting that sort of classic museum-type artwork design, which is why they call it Museum Collection. Um, 
Arthur saying it's probably John, Johnny Bench. Well, you, sh- you should have got him again, Arthur. Avoid that situation from ever happening. There's Barry Larkin. And on the other side is 2 out of 10, Jose Altuve, gold ink autograph on the gold frame for Joe Ivers and the Astros. Is that dazzling enough? That's going to make Twitter. Is there a little bit of dust on there? Even though they beat my Dodgers in the World Series. There you go. Joe Ivers dazzled. Check. All right. Next up. Good luck. Oh, no, it's all good, Ben. I just didn't just misread your question at first. Yeah, Tops always Tops does a great job with with their uh, with the design of these products. All right, next box. And after this, the second half of the case already sold out. So we'll do that and then we'll do a separate video for the break credit. And there's a fresh case of museum collection posted on jazbeeshobbyland.com right now. So check it out. Check it out and don't miss out on the big hits. Oh, did I hit the wrong button? <laughs> Sorry. Edwin Encarnacion, Clemens, and Nolan Arenado. Roger Clemens, Corey Kluber, and Johnny Bench. Nolan Arenado, Mookie Betts, Bo Jackson. And then we got the Baby Ruth. Who's Baby Ruth? Six out of 50 on that one. Nice one for the Yankees. Scott McNulty with that. All right, behind Chris Bryant is... Jonathan Scope, 49 out of 75. Quad relics, some nice colors in there. Behind Cal Ripken is Trey Mancini, 24 out of 50. Nice, that goes to Michael Booth in the O's. Along with that Jonathan Scope. And that Cal Ripken Jr. base card. Behind Freddie Freeman, we have a dual relic for the Cubbies. Addison Russell, Javier Baez. Three out of 50. Meaningful materials. That'll go to Scott McNulty. And behind the Stanton is a Pirate. Two out of five Pirate. Look at that. There's dirt. On that jersey, too. Game used. Josh Harrison. Triple relic and autograph. Out of fives and under are train whistles, Nicholas Leslie, as you know. There you go. All aboard! Whoop, whoop! Nice hits out of here. Folks, this stuff is hot. We should do another case tonight. I know it's a little bit, museum collection is pricier, but scared money don't make money. Go big or go home. It is Saturday. You're not going to see us until Tuesday. So you might as, might as well. Look at the dirt. I, I love it when there's infield dirt on there. You can see like the reddish brownish clay of the infield dirt right here. It's kind of hard to see, but maybe in that lighting you can kind of see it. That red light is from... A reflection on the microphone, but that's cool, right? My favorite, favorite when I see stuff like that. 
Because, you know, sometimes cynics, sometimes the cynical people are like, Game used, really? Really? You know, the top's probably probably screwing us. No, but when you see dirt like that, you're like, yeah, okay, that's definitely game used. <laughs> All right, next box. Good luck, everybody. We're only halfway through. Alright, good luck everybody. Breeze through the base cards here. Everything ships, you're getting all of that stuff too, folks. Not a not a big sorting challenge in this. Alright. Oh, let's get Jackie Robinson, of course, out of one fifty. Going to the Dodgers. Eric with my Dodgers. All right, so behind Cody Bellinger, we have more Orioles. Manny Machado. 122 out of 149. Two-color triple relic Machado Auto. That goes to Michael Booth and the O's. Along with that Adam Jones win. <laughs> Where does Manny Machado go? They got to move Adam Jones. They got to move Manny Machado. They got to start over on that team. Primary piece is Luis Severino, Tanaka, Chapman, Sonny Gray. Nice quad relic for uh, Richard Burbank and the Rocks. Behind Big Poppy is... Another Pirate, 22 out of 50, Andrew McCutcheon. And behind the sketch, Ted Williams is 28 out of 299, J.D. Davis for the Astros. Joe Ivers with that one. Oh, Dodgers designed to play some baseball against Herman Marquez, huh? Bottom of the ninth. I think the only announcer is announcing that uh, the Dodgers only managed five hits off of Herman Marquez. Come on, Dodgers. Joe Ivers wants the Mets boxes to open up. We hit, I think, we think we hit a Met autograph in every break. One, two, three, and four. It's pretty thick. One of one, maybe. Oh, did I say Rockies? I was, maybe I was half paying. It doesn't matter what I say, Scott McNulty. It doesn't matter what I say. I could say that everything goes to the Dodgers, but it won't. Because the shipping team will look at that, will know it's Yankees, and they'll send it to you. Did I, say, did I really say Rockies? It's a long week, Scott McNulty. Long week. All right. Oh, well, Patrick, yeah. Patrick, doesn't matter what I say. As long as as long as long your names are still on that list as Yankees, the guys who sort that stuff out, I'll get it to you. Patrick, he'll get it. You'll, you'll, you'll get it, Patrick. He'll, he'll, he'll learn, Scott, that my, 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 my voice is not word. <laughs> All right. There are a couple numbered cards there. Got a couple of these guys there.
All right, there's the Professor Greg Maddox. And then we've got some Metropolitans. Noah Syndergaard, Jacob deGrom, Yoannis Espedes, and Michael Conforto, 74 out of 75. There you go, Joe Ivers. How many train whistles? What, in this break alone or just all day? I think there's been three in this break alone. Two in this break alone. Maybe more. There's Addison Russell for the Cubs, 99 out of 99. Dual relic and autograph for Scott McNulty and the Cubbies. Behind Conforto is Luis Severino. Nice. 50 out of 299 for the Yanks. Scott McNulty with the Yankees. Get out. Oh, it's not going to get out. It's the Rockies. All right. And whoa, look at this. There's Rhino. Wow. MLB logo, man. It's a one of one Anthony Rendon for Robert Rohr and the Nationals. Wow. All aboard. Woo -woo. I love these logo men. These are great. What a patch. I think I don't think this is going to even fit in a 180. This is going to have to go into Well, we'll have to set this aside. It's going to have to go into a slider box. There you go. Yeah, Joe Ivers was saying that hey, he he felt a monster was going to pop out of here. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, that's the those are the kind of hits that are being pulled out of Museum Collection Baseball here at Jaspie's Hobbyland. We've got another half, two half case breaks in the store right now. So go to jazbeeshobbyland.com and make it happen. And pull stuff like that. That's what, three train whistles in this break? There's usually multiple train whistles in every case, ladies and gentlemen. So get into it. Uh, I don't know if that Severino was jersey number. I got this. Look at this, though. <laughs> I mean, maybe. I don't know. We'll, we'll post the video. We'll find out. Man, what a... That big MLB patch is strong. Um, I think you can rewind Clemson cards. But make sure you come back live on that Severino. I don't know what his jersey is. All right, here we go. Let's finish strong. Look at it. <laughs> Be kind and rewind. Man, when's the last time anyone's heard that phrase? Out of 150, Buster Posey. Out of 99, Andrew McCutcheon. Some base cards. Everything ships, of course. There's Strasburg. Behind Strasburg is a Yankee, Jacoby Ellsbury. 21 out of 25. Nice one for the Yankees. The Bronx Bombers. Mur the modern-day murderer's row. Exists. Jacoby Ellsbury part of that, kind of. Behind Nolan Ryan is a Jacob deGrom, 71 out of 299. That goes to Amazing. H O F. Behind the Wizard is a dual relic and autograph, Ozzy Albius. Nice one for Eric and the Bravos. 100 out of 299. 
Hashtag chop on. Nice. And last but not least, behind Willie McCovey, is primary pieces quad relic Ian Kinsler. 68 out of 99 for the on hells. That'll be for EA. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. What a break in the books. An amazing hit right here. One of one for the Nats. Congrats to Robert Rohr again on that one. This has been a great half case break. Second half coming up. That's right, Joe Ivers. Let's break two. We'll see you for the next one. Bye-bye.